To enhance my robot's perception, I've added object detection functionality. The robot now processes the color image stream from its camera using a model agnostic node, meaning it can swap in any object detection model. In this particular demo, I'm using the Facebook model that is pre-trained on the Coco dataset. It recognizes 80 common objects, uh, some of which you will see on the video. Uh, however, I would say that my main focus is uh, people detection for practical use cases. My robot's depth camera provides not just color but also distance data for each pixel. With this information, I can segment objects and generate a 3D point cloud. I also create a 3D bounding box around each object, which is more useful than the raw point cloud for the future applications. I also can combine the point cloud with the original color data of each pixel to create a full 3D representation of the objects, which is great for visualization. And here is how it all comes together on the robot. The camera is currently mounted low, limiting its view, but it's still able to detect people in front of it. The robot combines this perception data with its existing mapping and localization features, correctly placing objects on the map generated by the navigation service. In the future, this will help me implement capabilities like person following and object seeking.